We're going to create a new mask here and create a border with it. I'm going to go to brush and the trick here is make sure all the mask is off and that feather is set way down to zero. Flow and density up full. So we're going to come up here with a brush selected and we're going to aim it so that the corner of the brush here, the circle is at the top corner. So we're getting the full width of our brush. So I'm going to click and then I'm going to hold the shift key and pull the whole way down. The shift click allows us to create a straight line. Do this around the whole of the border. Click and shift click. Okay, that's all of the edges. Jump into exposure and increase that the whole way. So you can see here we started to make our border white. So what we're going to do now is we're just going to duplicate that. Okay, so everything should be really white. That's a way to create a quick white border. Now, you might say, can't you create a border by using scale inside transform? Well, you could, except there's one problem here. Let me just scale here for a second. And we see that we've got a kind of a bendy image and this is a pre-cropped image. So it was actually pre-cropped to a five by four shape from its original six by four shape. So scale doesn't always work in that. Obviously, if you wanted to create a black border, you could come in here and with our mask, what you can do is just bring the exposure all the way down and, and the same here. Okay, and that will give us a black border. Elevate your photo editing skills at the Kelby One Lightroom Conference. Learn from the experts and transform your photography. Sign up at kelbyonelive.com.